How's it going everybody? It's Pete J. Welcome on in. We're going to play a, do a little Euro Truck Simulator 2. Um, uh, what you did not see, because I haven't edited the video and put it up yet, was there was another update. So after our trip from Calvia, uh, from Calvi to Bastia, um, we were reset once again back to our home garage in Calvi. Um, I was able to take a load. I'm sorry about that. That was a little um, tricky. Uh, I was able to take a load from um, Calvi to Ajaco. I stopped for the night here at this motel, this scenic motel on the freeway, uh, on the motorway. Had a little breakfast over here. We're about to get going. Um, the problem I encountered was uh, I was trying to set up my broadcast, and as I did so, I went to hit the uh, buttons to... Uh, get the broadcast uh, the recording started and I wound up spawning my truck from way up here and it dropped to the ground <laughs> and landed on its side and so we have uh, a monumental amount of damage to our truck we're going to jump right back into the uh, the cockpit uh, into the uh, driver's seat here and we'll go through and I will show you that we have 34 percent damage <laughs> to our truck um, after I dropped it from a considerable height. So what we're going to do first is we're going to need to take a quick gander at the uh, at the world map. Let's go ahead and find the uh, service station is right here. So we're going to head right into town and get service because uh, I just in the short time since I've got this up and running, I've already had problems trying to start the engine. So um, okay, here we go. Engine malfunction. Visit service station soon. Okay. So there's that. So let's go ahead and back out. Loan installment. All right. We're going to make our way out of here. Hopefully we'll be able to get to the service station before the engine dies. Like I say, this is a crummy way to start the game but uh, it happens periodically I was unaware that alt function F9 while not only okay let's find a new route well not only uh, starting my uh, broadcast my recording uh, also sp <laughs> spawns in your truck so uh, so I don't know if I will keep this. I kind of like the picturesque uh, shot of the uh, the hotel there on the on the freeway. Um, some of the traffic going by. Um, maybe I'll just turn it into a still and I'll put it at the head of the video. Whoop. Um, but yes, we're in Ajaco. Um, it was a quick trip. And I did a lot of walking around in Ajago in the uh, day, during the daylight hours. A train going by over here. Um, it was a lot of meandering. It was an impromptu trip, so I didn't have at the roundabout. Take the first exit. Anything planned out, um, so to speak. So it was it exit was, now. Was not a very on point. I, I should really. Uh, edit it up before I post it. Oh, well, we're back in Ajaco. At um, the roundabout, take the third exit. Not only did we uh, deliver here to Ajaco, but we also had uh, a delivery, you know, inside of Ajaco proper. So we did two exit runs. Now. VHV. Um, and like I said, once I finished my first run, I stayed um, at the service station we're going to. Get ready to turn left. Got up at about 2300 uh, hours, which would be about 11 o'clock. And uh, I took a, a short run from uh, the BHV left. here to uh, Trado. So, it's all over now. Jeez, uh, Sky, you're so depressing. Right? <laughs> all right. We made it. We're going to have to uh, spend some money we didn't want to or shouldn't have to spend, but. Wow. All right. A total of 21,000. We don't even have enough money to make the repairs. All right. We want the engine and the transmission. 
Uh, all right, we'll have to keep the the cabin till we can make some more cash. Okay, well here we are in Ajaco. Um, we are at the service station. I was able to get my uh, most of my mechanics fixed. Um, we're gonna go ahead and pull up right here. Parking brake, and we might as well shut off the engine for a while. We're gonna take a look at the job market. Oh, uh, let's look at the world map first. As you can see, I did. Uh, I got into Ajaco and I've, I've toured around. I found uh, that there's a, a Mon dealership over here. Um, there's a uh, recruitment center over here. Um, so we did. We did a, a kind of a tour around Ajaco. What we're looking for now, though, is something south. If we can pick up something, preferably to Bonifacio, since we have not discovered it. Um, even Porto Vecchio would be fine because we'd, we'd be able to take this route south. Um, or if we can find something, again, Le, Le Rousset, uh would be great because we haven't discovered it. But even if we could get up into Bastia, go to the car for in Bastia, at least we'd be able to do a better job of discovering that as well. So when we go to the freight market, that's what we're going to be looking for. Is stuff from Ajaco to either... Little Rousset or Porto Vecchio or uh, I mean uh, Bonifacio or Porto Vecchio. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and just jump to the last page. Bastia, Cagliari, Claremont, Marseille, Naples, Olbia, Montpellier, Sassari, Olbia. Okay, so we got nothing. <laughs> nothing. Well, Bastia. Okay, that's what we were saying. Carrefour. Um, actually, it's going from the Carrefour to the GNT, but that's okay. We've got two minutes to get there. We'll go ahead and jump on that. And let's get going. Ready to roll. we got two minutes. Oh, come on, man. I just had it serviced. Service engine soon. I just had my engine serviced. The only thing left is the uh, cabin. All right, so we gotta get to the car for here. Turn right. Let me just go through my onboard diagnostics. Still telling me 27%. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Second exit. My car, my Exit vehicle now. died. This is not going to work. I'm, <laughs> I'm not going to get the bass. Get ready to turn left. All right, folks, this is going to be an interesting one, huh? Turn left. All right, turn left. Here we are, safe and sound. That's right, safe and sound. Freight market. And it's gone already. So what I got left is Olbia and Cagliari. Those are on the other. Use plastics. Ajaco to Ajaco. We'll take that job. Let's do this. Hopefully it'll give us some money. We can get more of our vehicle fixed. <laughs> and the Trotto is over there by the uh, service station actually. So this should work out pretty good. Hopefully uh, a couple hundred bucks will help us. not paying attention to what I'm doing and that's not good for a truck driver truck drivers need to pay attention to what they're doing all right this is an ugly angle let's go ahead and straighten out a bit not good <laughs> <laughs> Not good times. All right. 
So the fast and reliable transport to Euro division is having its uh, having its troubles here. I may wind up having to take an, a loan from the bank if they'll give me one. Again, I kind of maxed out my uh, credit in order to buy the uh, the garage in Calvi, and that was to keep me from having to uh, again with all the updates being reset to Cologne. So okay. Looks good. Let's hit the uh, two Drive bars. Safe. Thank you, Sky. There we go. Jump back in. I'll try and make this a quick run here. So, uh, hopefully everything's going well with everybody. I appreciate you uh, tuning in. Sorry, we kind of just jumped in with both feet here. I've been off... Uh, off the streaming for a while, off the broadcast for a bit um, last Turn week. Right. I did not uh, get a chance to do much. And I'm trying to settle into a, uh, a regular schedule, but uh, so far, not so good. So we're, we're <laughs> I'm trying to do the best I can. Um, At the roundabout, take the second exit. We're... Uh, Exit now. I don't know how you're supposed to handle those. I'm an American driver. We don't have many roundabouts. So, uh, for me, get if, ready to turn right. am I supposed to stop when I get to those things? Or the way I've been, I've been playing it is if you've got the uh, space. Turn right and then turn right. If you've got the space, go ahead and take it. Ooh, car's coming. Turn right. I hit a vehicle. Finally, we are here. I hit a vehicle. How did I hit a vehicle? Um, forty. I'm not sure how I hit that vehicle. This shouldn't be much of a problem, except for my engine dying. <laughs> All right, 954 euros I've got. Nope, didn't take enough. All right. I had the room, I don't know why I didn't use it. A little tight on this side, but that's okay. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and put it, parking brake on, put it in gear, take a quick look out and about. Looks good to me, all four sides. Decoupling. Excellent work. Plastics from Ajiko to Ajiko, three kilometers, 15 minutes, 2.3 liters of fuel. Base reward on three kilometers is 612 euro, three experience points, proficiency bonus of level 13, plus two euro, trailer maneuvering bonus of plus 40 XP for a total of 614 euro, 43 XP. And we need to, uh, we need some diagnostics here. What do we got? 27% for the cabin. And that's 4,283 euros. We only have 1,568 euro. How's our standing with the bank? 
Um, all right. I can borrow fifty thousand dollars. Fifty thousand euro. What was my diagnostics again? Four thousand. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and take the ten thousand euro loan. Um, Thirty-five days, twenty-three percent. Yes, I will confirm that. Okay, so there we go. Another ten thousand euros. Let's get to the service station, and then we'll see what we can handle here. Um, oops, wrong button. That button there. We're going back to the service station, which I believe is over here somewhere. I may wind up. I may wind up messing around and buying this garage here in Ajaco. I've been around <laughs> around this town so much. I think it's off to the left here. Yeah, there it is over there. All right, we got the move here. There it is right here. I think I'm out in the street. And then a quick left and we are back to the service station. So let's hope, beyond hope. All right, parking brake on. We need some repair work down here, service. All right, we got one euro for the engine, two euros for the chassis, 4,283 euros for the cabin, which I don't know why that keeps killing my engine, but total of 4,286 euro making the repairs. All right, we're back up to where we should have been when we started. Um, all right, so as long as we're here at the service station, let's take another gander at the uh, job market. Let's see what we got. Again, looking for bon uh, Bastia, Le Rousset, Bonifacio, or Porto Vecchio. Coming out of Ajaco. Sassari. We will be heading over to the Italian island of Sardinia soon. But I would like to finish off the French island of Corsica first. Colliery Bastia. The BHV has uh, Brocco vans. Six tons of Brocco vans going to GNT in Bastia. Um, it is fragile cargo. It is standard delivery, and it is a high-value cargo. 4,468 euro, 29,380 kilometers. Let's get that one. Time to hit the road. 19 minutes to respond to that. Okay, so uh, let's do that then. Turn off the uh, parking brake. All right, that's just gonna make it harder too when you go to, uh, I'd like to buy another truck. I mentioned buying another uh, garage. I'd like to do that as well. So uh, make it a left. No, I'm not going backwards. Why am I? Okay. Turn left. Turning left, Sky. Get ready to turn left. All right. Turn left. At the BHV here. You have arrived at your destination. Your route guidance is now finished. Well, don't go too far, Sky. We got a, we got a job to do here. All right, I should go to Bastia. We're going to take that job. Okay. Here we go. Some Baracco vans. Some Baracco. Never mind. <laughs> That's going to make it go. Um, so the Baracco vans are back here. I think this is the first time I will be taking this uh, cargo here. Car carrier. Yeah, I believe this is my first car carrier. Um, I might have done one earlier on in American Truck Sim, but 
Not since then. Okay. There it is. It's a little bit harder than I want to do that, but put the parking brake on, put it in gear. Let's take a walk around. Some Brocco van trailers. Got a blue one, a white one, and a silver. Everything looks good. We'll go ahead and hit the uh, T-bar. Let's do this. Yes, ma'am. Bang, here we go. Jump in the cab. Take a quick gander at the uh, route that they got us going on because, again, we want to make sure that we are picking up any and all um, Yeah, we could do that, I think. I mean, we could always come around 132 kilometers, 2 hours, 13 minutes. That helps us discover a little bit more. So why don't we do that? It doesn't really add a whole lot more. 2 hours, 11 minutes to uh, 2 hours, 13 minutes. We'll go ahead and take that. Let's get on the road, though. Okay, so from the BHV in Ajako to the GNT in Bastia. We are expected uh, Tuesday, 1334 to Tuesday, 2014. Our job income will be 4,468 euros, 29.3 euros a kilometer. Our mass is 6,150 kilograms. Drive safe. That seems like it's an awful tight time, <laughs> time frame, doesn't it? All right. So we're full up, we're ready to rock and roll. Making a right out of here. Those are the cleanest windows in Ashiko. Turn right. I've been swinging wide. I don't know why, I'm not trusting myself pulling out of these places. They all got those fences. There's no openings, uh, wide openings, that's for sure. So, uh, oops, speeding violation. Jeez. I think it's 50 here. At the roundabout, take the first exit. The first exit. Okay, see I'm not seeing anybody and that looks like a yield sign to me. Exit so. now. Let's say 80, 50, this is 50. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Second exit. Again, I don't see anybody on the roundabout, so I'm just going to pull out. Exit now. All right. All right, we're on the road. Hopefully there's not a lot of roundabouts <laughs> until we get closer to Bastia anyway. Driving through. Posted on my lane a little bit. Let me jump back in just for this. For these turns, I like to be in the uh, driver's seat. It does, uh, I think it helps a lot better. Yeah, it's 80, 80 kilometers an hour. I'm only doing about 60. There's the hotel I stayed at there, um, just outside of Ajako. Corte. I'm not sure if this is a discoverable town here. I gotta be careful, this is uh, 50. Okay, we gotta come down. 
At the roundabout, take the first exit. First exit. Again, I don't see anybody. Oh, there was somebody. Exit now. All right, so I don't know what this town is. Corte, it looked like it said. Go straight on. Get back in the truck. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, hitting all the wrong buttons. So it's been a little while since I've played. Okay, so we're moving straight on from here. Um, this is the uh, town of Corte, it looks like. Pretty little uh, village here. a car accident there and I almost joined it but all right let's stay here for a little bit let's <laughs> all right so we're leaving Corte um, on our way to Bastia which is the upper northeast and uh, Ajaco is kind of the middle of the the west side though the west edge of uh, of the island so we got a little bit of a, a ride in front of us here again the uh, the roadways here are very difficult uh, very twisty and turning very windy uh, it makes it very difficult for any kind of outside camera work um, Although I'm not really sure we're going downhill, so we're picking up speed as we're moving along here. Just want to make sure you're high enough in the lane. Ooh, you don't want to hit the guide rail, guardrail, but you don't want to drag your... Montalision, another little town here, which again I don't believe is, is is not discoverable. Maybe in some future update, but right now it's just a drive-through. So heading through here, and another. At the roundabout, take the first exit. You got it. And there's nobody in the roundabout, so we're gonna go ahead and cruise. Exit now. Try and stay high. Whoop whoop. Thirty kilometers an hour through town here. Wow, this is a nice little town. Lady on the uh, balcony there. Let's see if I can do this without creating problems. Yeah, I think I'm going to get you up back in. <laughs> Alright, so this is uh, Point Lycia. Lycia. Uh, again, another small town. Hopefully at some point there will be an update and they'll be able to add a couple of more villages to these, a couple of more village stops to these, the islands. Uh, especially Sardinia, uh, which only has the three. It's got Olbia, Cesare, and uh, Cagliari. So, uh, yeah. So it'd be nice to see a couple of a couple of more stops there. But yeah, this is this is some uh, this is some difficult driving here on these these island roads. This will test your skill as a driver. <laughs> See, I'm going downhill, picking up speed fast. Yeah. 
I had to jump on the brake there because we were getting a little too quick. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Take the second exit at the roundabout. Okay. It's not this one. But we're going to make it around. We're going to pick up this exit, now. this exit here. I'm not sure if I'm sold on the uh, roundabouts. Um... I guess in uh, in the U.S. we would have a, a four-way stop, a traffic light, or, or a stop stop light uh, stop sign. Um, I don't. I, I you know maybe it's just me because of what I'm used to, but I, I think you can accomplish pretty much the same thing with a four-way stop, and uh, I think it's just a, a lot easier to to figure out these roundabouts could get a little. Nutty. All right, here's at another. At the roundabout, one. take the second exit. Second exit at the roundabout. Again, no traffic, so I'm just gonna breeze right in and right out. I don't know if that's what I'm supposed exit to now. do, but uh, that's what I'm doing. Ooh, a little bit of curb action there. Um, so yeah, as we uh, make our way to Pit Bastia here, um, 80 kilometers an hour here, we should pick up some speed too, because we're we are probably gonna be pushing. Pretty close to being late. Uh, I just wanted to remind everybody tomorrow will be game three of the semifinal playoff series between the Overdogs and the Buzzards. Um, it is a it is tied up 1-1. Um, this is the the brawl for it all, so to speak. Uh, winner of this game goes on to the next bracket. Loser goes home. So uh, season's over. Uh, the uh, at the roundabout, take the first exit. The, uh, the Overdogs took the first game of the series. Um, we were able to come fight back and, and get back into it uh, in the second game of the series, uh, tying it up and, and forcing a game three. Um, it's going to be at Sakura Hills, exit now. which is the Buzzards' home. Uh, that's their home arena. So. Uh, Keep right. We'll be uh, we'll be the visitors. Um, second game At was the roundabout. Take the second exit. Was almost a, a complete opposite of the first game, and uh, we the, whereas their hitters really kind of beat us up in the first game. Exit in the, now. In the second game, they really uh, they really struggled against our pit pitching. Chasey Kim put on a show. Get ready to turn left. And uh, single-handedly kept us in that game. So, uh, you know, won that game for us. So, turn left. Really good, really good game. Um, we're looking for, we're hoping for a similar situation tomorrow night. We're hoping for another. This is where it is. Major pitching situation. Uh, and uh, and more offense. Our offense has been uh, very quiet. So. It's definitely do or die time, so um, so we're going to, I got somebody honking at me. I don't have a window back there. Shut up. <laughs> All right, I think we are clear of the fence. I did not hit that car. I'm going to try and get in this corner here. Okay. It's going to be a left-hand side, which is the side I've been struggling with here for a while. Yeah, I've lost my ability to go, go to the left, so... Um, let's see.
Whoa. That ain't good. That's not good. Well, I'm not a big fan of this parking method, but uh, I'm having trouble going to my left for some reason. There's a bus stop. All right, here we go. I'm not hearing any music, so I'm assuming we're still on time, right? All right, so there's that. Parking brake, put it in gear. Let's jump outside, take a look. We got uh, green on this side. We got green on that side, looks good. Let's go ahead and drop the T-bar and hand this off. Make a little money. There it is. Brocco Vans delivered from Ajago to Bastia. We drove 137 kilometers. It took us three hours and five minutes. Uh, we consumed 70 and a half liters of fuel. Base reward on 137 kilometers is 3,374 uh, euros and 137 experience points. The proficiency bonus for level 13 is 540 euros. High value cargo bonus, skill rank of 2, 277 euros and 24 experience points. Fragile cargo bonus, skill rank of 2, 277 euro, 30 experience points. Trailer maneuvering bonus of 90 XP experience points for a total of 4,468 euro, 281 experience points. We're trying to make our way up to level 14. We're at 20,520 experience points. We need to get to 21,600. Take a quick gander at the uh, Cesare and Montpierre. Cesare is on the Italian island of uh, Sardinia. Montpierre is on uh, mainland France, so we're not really interested in going there. Anything in the external contracts, maybe, that we can take from Bastia to somewhere we need to go? No. <laughs> Not at all. Cesare, uh, Nice, and Naples. So, no, we got nothing going on there. All right, so that was a good move. We got up here. We found, uh, found the GNT. There's a bus stop over here. We'll go over there and, and find that. There's a garage for sale here and a car for. There's a hotel. At which point, if we just take the ride to the FLE... <laughs> We'll have discovered all of this up here. So let's go check out the bus stop. Actually, uh, I'm going to go this way. And then we're going to end up here at the, at the garage. No, this is going to be three. All right. So let's go in and let's drop around a little bit. Ready to roll. Yes, ma'am. Jump in the cab, turn off the parking brake. Um, is there a way out on the other side of this? Yes, there is, okay. Of this GNT, right? It's a GNT. Yes, GNT, there's the plain beautiful day everybody's out washing windows here 
once we get to the hotel, we'll go ahead and pull out Turn the drone. Right. And we'll take a better look around Bastia here. Roundabout, take the second exit. Not sure what that is over there. Looks like I got a, kind of a farmer's market or something. Second exit. Just jumped out in front of that car, but that's okay. I'm a truck driver now. World of Trucks store, Luna Park. Ooh. Keep left. Oh no. And then Ouch. turn left. Ouch. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. I don't think there is a a line, is there? There's the car four. Green, okay. So yeah, so they have the roundabouts and yet they still have these two. Please stop. He's waiting for me. Uh oh. <laughs> car four. Whoop. Okay, so this car four. Turn left. Yeah, this car four looks a lot like the one in uh Ajiko. Make Turn a left. left. Make a left here. Alright, I can't really see anything around this mirror. There's a couple cars coming. That one's turning. Alright, here we go. Ready to turn left. You got it, Sky. Where are we at, Sky? Seems like we're on the back side of Bastia over here. Turn left. Here oh. we are. Safe and sound. It's the bus stop. You have to discover all the bus stops. I don't know why. I don't know if there's a... Uh, if you wind up unlocking something or if there's an achievement for it. There's the uh, vans we just dropped off. But this is a bus stop in Bastia. Um, and again, I'm not sure, that, but they, you know, you can you can drive into them, so I do. They light up on the map when you do that, so I drive into them. All right, so bus stop. World map. Where are we at? We're there, and we want to go to here. Or we're going to go this way because I've discovered all of that. No. Nope. Right. So there we go. Okay, here we go. Make it a left. Truck pulling trucks. So up, Tommy. Oh. Turn left. Almost hit that car. Too busy making small talk. All right, so here's a garage for sale in Bastia. Over here. Um, again, as you saw at the beginning, I don't have. Here's the service station. Right next to the garage for sale. Get ready to turn left. You got it, Sky. BHV. Mio Bolero. Turn left. Ooh. I hit it. Sorry about that, dude. I tapped him. Get ready to turn right. Alright, so let's find the hotel here in Bastia. Turn right. Oh. It's 
all over now. Well, I wouldn't be so so manic about it, Sky. But uh, yeah. So yeah, this this uh, motel looks a lot like the one that we were just at in Ashiko. Um, only instead of being out on the uh, highway there, it's uh, into a uh, city here. I don't think I've ever seen a trailer like this before. We got a, a rump, rump trailer. Oop, I'm not. Pay attention to what you're doing, Joe. Are you kidding me? Can I not stay here? Oh. I think I found another place. Um, recently over by Portland, there's a, in the American Truck Simulator, there is a, a truck stop, okay? And yet, it does not let you rest. There we go, let's just say. All right, let's turn that off. Let's turn that off. Let's do some paperwork. Let's take a look at the world map. I would have to say that, uh, again, Lil Rousset we got to get to. And maybe it's just worth it to make the drive over there and pick something up over at the Ilolo lines. Although, it's weird because it does not show that there's any there's any ships sailing out of this port and yet I don't know of anything that goes to the Ilolo lines. The FLE is over here. Um, we've done a pretty good job of discovering much of the roadway. We're, we're getting ready to basically move to the southern portion and see what we can do down there. So we're in Bastia, Cesare, Palermo, Olbia, Nice, Naples, Montpierre. Okay. Uh, Clermont, Lyon, Marseille. So I'm not seeing much. Uh, we're going to look at the bank. We owe the bank uh, a total of 560,000 euros. Um, we have 455,699 bureau left of repay we've got 14,109 euro I'm gonna repay this one just to get it off the books um, so we still have three outstanding loans um, but we have four thousand one hundred nine dollars which I don't know if that's going to be enough for a loan payment so that <laughs> I may be going into arrears here in a moment. Um, yeah, yeah. 10,122 uh, euros a, a day. So truck dealerships, again, it doesn't much matter because I don't have any money. Scania dealer and Amon dealer. Um, there's one more over here in Sassari that we will discover once we get there. Um, I'm kind of hoping that I can get Amon for my next truck. My garage manager, I have my home garage in Cologne. I have a uh, satellite in Calvi. I currently only have, I have uh, two trucks, a DAF and the Volvo. I have two drivers, me and Steve W. Steve W just uh, leveled up not too long ago. So I would like to purchase another vehicle, purchase another garage. I'd like to upgrade the two garages I have. And I'd like to get uh, Steve W uh, a co-worker in Cologne so those are the things that are on the docket whether or not that's going to happen I don't you know again you saw the debt that we are in Bastia Olbia Olbia all right well what we'll just do then is we will go ahead and rest Starting to get a little bit of rain here. Take a new look at the uh, job market. Great market. Here we go. We are in Bastia, Cesarea, Porto Vecchio, Lavender, Porto Vecchio, Palermo, Olbia, Montpierre, Marseille, Lyon, Lourousse. Okay, okay. 
Bastia, Bastia, and I should go. Four minutes. I'm going to take that if we can get there. I don't even know if we're going to get there. Time to hit the road. Oh. Sorry. It was so quiet, I didn't think it was on. speeding but I gotta get there quick I don't think I'm gonna get there this is gonna bum me out because it's not it's too far away I finally get the load I want and I can't I can't get it Yeah, this is the FLE. This is going to be way out there in the boonies. And I only had like four minutes, I think. So I think it was a pipe dream. racing for because I'm not going to get it, so. Uh-oh. Well, perfect capper to a... <laughs> Head on collision with a bus. end up having to uh, get towed I think because I don't think there's a service station out here you know what um, yeah so that's where we're at That sucked. I think I'm going to shut her down here. I'm not helping myself at all, am I? Turn off the wipers. Turn off the lights. Back in the cockpit. Shut that down. Yeah, and I just, uh, I screwed everything up. Another bad one, folks. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, so we had to get down here in four minutes from way up there, and that's not going to happen. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm going to publish this one. <laughs> this is another crap one. All right, well, bye. <laughs>